Hi guys, I wanted to get the feed up and running, uh, but also let you know that I am still probably uh, three or four minutes from actually starting to do the break. That is because I don't quite have our spreadsheet finished. Um, had a little bit of a problem earlier with my internet connection dropping in and out. I think that seems to be resolved now, but as a result, I'm also a little bit behind. So the stream is up and running, as you can see. I will be back to start the break uh, in just a couple of minutes. I just need to finish up these spreadsheets. Again, for anybody that jumped in uh, after I made the first announcement, I'm finishing up the spreadsheet. Uh, I'm a little bit uh, delayed tonight, so we will actually start the break, as in breaking into the first item in another couple of minutes. Just hang tight, please.
Almost done, guys. Hang tight. As soon as the spreadsheet is finished, we'll be starting. Okay, let me just get it up in our viewer here, and then we're going to be good to go. Once again, I apologize for the delay, and let me also say, uh, as I mentioned before, I have had a little bit of an unstable connection today. If we lose the feed for any reason, if it stalls or goes down or whatever in the middle of the break, um, just hang tight there and know that I will be doing everything I can to get it back up. I'm hoping... That we don't have that problem but it has been very um in and out for the last several hours for whatever reason <clears throat> i did see the cable truck parked across the street earlier but one would think they would be fixing something not breaking something but anyway there you go so let's go ahead and take a look at our first break this is one box of 2017 onyx preferred players edition autograph baseball this is the national edition, which, uh, you know, had a different player checklist than the regular 2017 preferred players. <clears throat> and, of course, our eBay end date was tonight, 10.25, our live stream schedule. Well, the live stream started at 9.45, but we didn't manage uh, to start breaking until just now. So we got uh, a little bit behind. I apologize. I did want to go ahead and have the stream up, though, so you weren't wondering what was going on. You'll see team names on the left, winning bidders across from it on the right. There are a few teams in there listed as no hits unlisted. Uh, that just means there was literally no hits on the checklist for that team, so I didn't even list it for sale. You will also see some things that say no bids buyback. Those are unsold teams. Anything comes out for one of those teams, it stays here with me. And finally, you will see a blank spot there for the Pittsburgh Pirates. And that's because it didn't show up as an unsold team, yet eBay also did not send me a notice saying that it was sold. So I'm not really quite sure what it is. And I was trying to research that. I have another team uh, on the Jumbo Break that has the same problem where I got nothing. I didn't get an end of transaction notice at all. It didn't say sold. It didn't say unsold. And I was kind of trying to track that down and then just decided, you know what, you guys have been sitting there waiting long enough for me to try to get the spreadsheet situated. And so I'll just figure that part out later. 
So here is our ball. Let's take a look at here, Dorsus Paulino. And you know what? Normally, you can see that a little better. Let's do this, and that's going to help us see it a little better. Now let's see if we can take a look a little bit closer up. <clears throat> so our COA is for Dorsus Paulino. Here's another little uh, COA in there with it as well. And let me find him on our spreadsheet, because honestly, I don't know what team he goes to. Indians, it says on the, on the uh, checklist. Cleveland Indians have Dorsus Paulino. And there's your little uh, Onyx sticker that goes with the little Onyx card that we saw. So our autograph baseball heading off to the Cleveland Indians. I'm just looking over there in chat. I see I made uh, several typos in chat when <laughs> I was trying to, in case someone had the volume down, I was also trying to type into chat that we were starting a little bit late. And of course I was trying to do that in chat while simultaneously doing the spreadsheet. I see I managed to make quite a few typos in the, in the chat notes. That's always entertaining. So our second break tonight uh, is our Topps Jumbo. And this is a half case break. It's the back half of a case that we started, uh, I don't know, maybe three, four days ago, recently, anyway. Have some real nice hits in the first half of the case. And this is the back part of it. And this is break number four, the fourth time we have broken it. And same format as before, the Arizona Diamondbacks are our team here where, where eBay sent me no notice Although I have found in the past, sometimes they show up in the middle of the night or the next day. I don't know. They get like caught up in the email system or something. I, of course, will research that and fill that in. Ditto for the missing team in the last break. I just didn't do it before because, you know, I was already having uh, issues getting us rolling on time. Now I'm just hoping. I need to find some wood to knock on there. <laughs> hoping that we don't have any problems with an unstable signal dropping in and out during the break. I hope not. Tell you though, it's been kind of one of those, I was going to say one of those days, but it really hasn't been one of those days. It's been one of those weeks where just, I don't know, it seems like every little minor thing that can go wrong and then cause something else to snowball and go wrong seems to have been on that path all week long. So anyway, let's just hope that, uh, as my friend, my friend would call that a gremlin attack. So let's just hope that the gremlins are done for today and maybe we don't have to worry about it for the rest of the evening. We can get through the break anyway, I hope, without any further issues. So there's a lot of base in here. Most of you know that already. And then in the middle of each of our packs, we'll have uh, some inserts and some photo variation short prints and, of course, our hits. Each box will have two relics, a manufactured relic and an all-star stitches relic, and then we'll also have an autograph card. We're going to find probably a fair amount of uh, these. There's actually two inserts coming to America, and the other one, I think, is M is for mashing. You'll notice it has the Rangers and the Astros on it. I'm going to set that aside, and I believe we will find plenty of those, in which case some will go to the Astros and some will go to the Rangers, and the rest will go to uh, our random bidding position, which I'm sure we're going to have because we will typically find some uh, announcer cards, you know, MLB network cards, uh, like from hosts and announcers and things, and those will go to a random bidding position that we'll do before we wrap up the break. This is numbered to 2017, and all of them that we pull that has that sort of olive green color down there will be numbered to 2017. This is one of our reprint cards, all Rookie Cup. We'll find uh, quite a few of those as we go through the break tonight. Josh Donaldson is our photo, one of our photo variation short prints. Once again, we'll find quite a number of those. Giancarlo here is numbered to 66. 
we usually find a handful of those and we will find quite a few of these that are the 30th anniversary parallels that one is of course Lewis Brinson and then we're back to our regular base cards after that so that's kind of how each pack is going to be set up with a lot of base a little uh, center with our inserts and our hits and then a lot more base on the back side shipping for this most likely is going to be Monday it's always possible I could get it out sooner I will try it's also possible it could slide a day later and go into Tuesday instead of Monday but my expectation is that it will get out the door to you on Monday and of course just bear in mind that uh, I will be traveling starting the middle of next week and I'll be traveling for several days so if uh, you send me messages or things and during that time allow you know an extra bit of time for me to respond I might not see them sometimes for maybe even a day Amir Garrett on our rookie insert for the Reds Neil Ramirez for the Mets is our hollow foil Jesse Winker is a photo variation short print untouchables insert Max Scherzer our first hit out and it is for the Blue Jays Anthony Alford on the 30th anniversary parallel there and also of course the things I have listed um, you will see there will be a few days probably after the last after the current auctions that are listed now after they end uh, it will probably be two or three days before new ones begin and again that's just because I'm going to be traveling and I don't want to uh, I don't like to have a lot of stuff going on in that case because I don't always have quick easy access to email And there is one thing uh, for sure I have learned about selling on eBay is people give you about two hours to respond if they have a problem with something. And if you haven't seen it or responded in like two hours, they just kind of lose their minds and, and uh, assume that you're somehow trying to harm them in some way, scam them or something. And it's like, oh, hey guys, no, <laughs> you know, you got to give me a few hours to answer, to see it and to answer it. But so I've learned over the years it's usually better just to not have a lot going on if you don't have a lot of email access. That's numbered to 2017. Insert Lewis Brinson, rookie. Hunter Renfro is our photo variation short print. Untouchables Roger Clemens insert. And then a Bryce Harper relic. This is the Hank Aaron Award manufactured relic. We'll find one of those in every box. So we've already found uh, two of our three hits out of the first two packs of this box. Of course, there are 10 packs in here. Each pack has 50 cards. So there are 500 cards per box, a total of 1,500 cards in the break. do have a little bit more jumbo uh, that hasn't been listed for sale yet and won't be listed until at some point after I come back so we'll get into that then uh, also have well the new stuff that came out today the archive signature series active players edition and the Bowman high tech both of which I've decided to wait to list until later since I'm going to be on the road a bit. Brett Anderson for the Cubs to 2017. Kyle Freeland rookie insert. Trey Mancini uh, is the photo variation short print. Another Roger Clemens untouchables. And I think we're back to, yeah, we're back to our regular cards after that. The one new thing that did come out today, um, which I am going to break beforehand, is National Treasures Baseball. 
that is already up for sale. It ends on Sunday. We'll break it Sunday night, and it will ship out uh, either Monday or Tuesday. So it will ship out either the day after the break or two days after the break at the most. This is one of our buyback cards. Uh, they're literally the original cards that Topps has bought back and then put these little stamps on it that say Rediscover Topps. That one was kind of a gold color stamp, I think. There are some variations based on the colors of those stamps. It tells you the degree of rarity. And most of the buyback cards, you know, they're going to have some wear and tear on them because they were out in circulation somewhere before Topps reacquired them and put them in this product. So generally you'll find that they have some imperfections, uh, some more so than others. Bryce Harper to 2017 for the Nats. A little Derek Jeter All-Rookie Cup. Ozuna is our photo variation short print. Senzatala, our 30th anniversary card. Our third hit out of this box, All-Star Game, uh, All-Star Stitches for the Yankees with uh, Bettences. Another buyback. This one, Mark, <coughs> excuse me, Mark Davidson for the Twins. It's kind of a copper-colored stamp on it. Can you tell that the weather's been changing around here? <laughs> it has got my uh, sinuses or allergies or something all, all out of whack. It had been nice and warm, and then we got a little bit of a storm that came through and cooled things down a lot. Actually, had some some hail coming down, which is crazy. And uh, we're going to go from, you know, what was a nice 70 degrees a few days ago. We may have snow tomorrow, <laughs> they're saying. So it's just crazy weather changes this time of year. Get the better of me sometimes. Andrew Kashner for the Rangers to 2017. All-Star Rookie Cup for the Red Sox. Bryce Harper uh, photo variation short print. That's a nice one. Haven't pulled that one before. Sean Newcomb, 30th anniversary. Here's one of our MLB Network uh, host cards that I was referencing earlier. We will go to random.org at the end of the break, and we'll talk about, uh, well, we won't talk about, we'll, we'll actually just put all the teams in there and let uh, Random decide which team will take home those MLB announcer and host cards, as well as, you know, excess that we have for the dual team cards. Of course, obviously, the first of the dual team cards will go to the teams depicted on the card, assuming that we have enough to do that. And then leftovers would go to the random position, or if we don't pull two of each one. If we were to only pull one, it would it would then just go to the random position. But I imagine it's going to be like the others and we'll pull several of each of those would be my guess. That has certainly been the case up to this point. I'll look at that for a second. I guess that is just the regular picture. For some reason it caught my eye. Matt Adams hollow foil for the Braves. Pujols all-star rookie cup or all rookie cup uh, reprint. Our short print photo variation this time. Ricky Henderson for the A's. Chris Davis for the A's is our 30th anniversary card. And then we're right back into our base again. You've probably noticed there have been a lot of uh, variations there of 
of Aaron Judge and Cody Bellinger. You know, there's a home run derby card. There's a card where they're batting. There's a card where they're fielding. Um, none of those, though, are short prints. There are some short print uh, Aaron Judge cards because we have pulled them. I'm assuming there's probably a short print uh, Bellinger as well. This is the other one I was talking about that has two teams on it. M is for mashing. We have the Orioles and the Red Sox on there. So that's another one that will be set aside and we'll determine the disposition of that uh, at the end of the break once we know what quantity we have of them. Anthony Alford for the Blue Jays to 2017. All-Rookie Cup for the Mariners, Ichiro. Amir Garrett for the Reds is our short print photo variation. Dallas Keuchel, I don't, I know that's not right, but, but you know who he is for the Astros. And if you happen to uh, jump in late and miss me saying it earlier, I do expect that uh, most of these cards from tonight will ship on either Monday or Tuesday. So we'll have to, I'll have to look up where Paul Shuey played. Wherever he played the longest, um, that's where that card will go because that's a Team USA uh, designation on that card. doesn't have the team name on there. So I will look it up. I'm sure he's retired. And in that case, it will go to the team that he played with the most seasons. Tim Anderson, throwback jersey insert for the White Sox. Hugh for the Rays on the hollow foil. There is a Bellinger short print. Speaking of, there's our photo variation uh, short print for Cody. So now we do know what it looks like. And of course, uh, my, my streak is intact. We have continued to pull Cody out of every product that he's been available in as a rookie this year. We pulled him last night out of uh, Bowman Chrome in an orange parallel to 25. Of course, <clears throat> we pulled a couple out of one of these Topps Jumbo breaks. I was starting to get a little nervous about that Bowman Chrome, you know. We've been through 10. That Well, that made... That was the 11th case of the regular Bowman Chrome, not counting the HTAs we've done, and hadn't found him yet. I was thinking, oh boy, is my streak uh, going to end? And then he popped up and in there last night and keeps the streak alive. For the Yankees to 2017, how to vague love work insert for the Astros. Gary Sanchez, photo variation short print for the Yankees. Untouchables for the Braves. Colby Rasmus to 50. Where did I, there's my Giancarlo. I couldn't find Giancarlo there for a minute. Because he's numbered to 66. I want to keep them in the same general vicinity in case we want to recap them. And looks like we have another Rediscover Tops. This one is Jack Morris for the Tigers. <clears throat> I 
And that was box one. Ah, as I dropped the box, that's always, that's always helpful, right? <laughs> always like to drop our box. Well, at least the good news is, so far, I need to find something wooden to knock on again there, but uh, so far so good with the connection remaining stable for the moment. So let's, uh, let's hope that it stays that way for the rest of the break. That is the 2017 Chris Sale for the Red Sox. Mark Trumbo walk-off insert for the Orioles. Derek Jeter for the Yankees is our photo variation short print. Untouchables Tom Seaver for the Mets. Our Hank Aaron Award is Miguel Cabrera for the Tigers. Yeah, honestly, you know, they built some townhouses uh, back here behind me. By now it's been a few years ago. But when they built them, the cable company took the cable, like whatever you want to call it, hub or whatever, that houses, you know, where everything runs through. This is for the Cubs. This is Rediscover Tops buyback card, a silver stamp on it. So they, they took it and like split it off and ran it back to, I think there are four, maybe five new townhouses back there. And ever since they did that, our services have never quite been right. So, you know, they tried to say they weren't really degrading the signal or blah, blah, blah by splitting it off and into five new houses. <laughs> but yet they had to because we've had so many problems since then. They were better for a while and, and lately not so good again. But, you know, we pay like a premium for the highest speed internet that you can get from them but i don't think we ever get the speeds that they say we're getting or that we're supposed to be getting or more to the point that we're paying for i don't think we ever get the speeds that we're paying for and of course they'll try to say oh it's you know this it's that it's the other but i still really think that it has to do with them splitting off the signal back there to those townhouses because that's when everything started Everybody had to start having problems after that. Nelson Cruz walk-off insert for the Mariners. Diaz for the Indians in the hollow foil. Jackie Robinson, Dodgers, photo variation short print. Untouchables, Whitey Ford for the Yankees. I think it's tomorrow night we have the back half of the uh, Topps Heritage Minor League that we started the other night. I'm pretty sure the back half of that is scheduled to end tomorrow night. So, you know, it's kind of a little different level of prospecting. It's in that, uh, you know, it's the same prospects that we would be looking for in Bowman and our other similar products. But, of course, they're in their minor league uniforms with the minor league team name on the card. And let me tell you, it takes a lot longer to sort than I thought it would. And that is primarily because, you know, I only know a handful of the affiliated teams. You know, like maybe I know the top one or two for most of the major league teams. 
So, but each major league team has, that is the 2017 on the Kyle Freeland. Verlander, All-Star Rookie Cup. Short print, Nolan Arenado for the Rockies, photo variation, short print. A little Aaron Judge in our 30th anniversary parallel. Paul Severino is one of our MLB host cards. But yeah, so each of our 30 major league teams have, you know, like six or eight minor league affiliates. So you're talking 150, 200 minor league teams. And I only remember maybe 30 or 40 of them, what team they're affiliated with. All oh, the rest of them I had to look them up. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, that was a very, very long sort. That is in a copper sort of color uh, stamp on there. Rob Dibble for the Reds. Yeah, I wish there was an easier way to sort that uh, Heritage Minor League because, whoo, man, I mean, that took like a whole entire day, basically, <laughs> to get that sorted and ready to go out the door. Like, it was crazy. I didn't think it was going to take anywhere near as long as it took. That is for the Royals, numbered to 2017, Dustin Pedroa. Brooks Robinson is our photo variation short print. Coda Glover, our 30th anniversary card. Yeah, I seriously wish that Tops would put the Major League affiliated team somewhere on the card, but I'm sure if they did that, then they would probably have to pay a, a big licensing fee to uh, Major League Baseball, whereas if they leave it like it is and it's all the minor league team names and the minor league uniforms, they probably get around that requirement and makes it a more cost-effective product to produce, that's my guess. But I just don't open enough minor league stuff to remember all of the affiliations. That's the main thing. Heritage is usually about the only minor league I do. I don't do most of the others pro debut in those. I don't do Jeff Locke for the Marlins. And then, of course, Bowman and all of those products, although, you know, they're the same prospects. Clearly, they're they're not in the minor league format, so makes it much easier to sort. For the Brewers, all rookie cup. For the Brewers, again, our photo variation short print, Lewis Brinson. Lucas Giolito, White Sox, our 30th anniversary card. I think we have five-star baseball coming out uh, next week, maybe. But I won't have time to break it before I'm, I'm on the road. So that will be another one I break when, we, when I get back. We'll be super busy once I get back. We're going to have so much stuff. We'll be breaking like crazy. Multi-sport breaking like crazy. For 
because we're about to hit the season where every week like three four new products come out or more dylan covey for the white Sox to 2017 franklin barreto barreto for the a's <coughs> sorry <coughs> let's try that again <coughs> That is our photo variation short print, Salvador Perez for the Royals. Untouchables, Felix Hernandez. <clears throat> and our signature hit for the Detroit Tigers, Joe Jimenez. Sorry about all the throat clearing and coughing. I know that's annoying. It annoys me too. Need to have that not happen. Would be better. <laughs> For the, for the Angels to 2017, <clears throat> Jesse Winker, rookie insert. John Smoltz for the Braves is our photo variation short print. Untouchables, Greg Maddox for the, Bra or for the Cubs, sorry. Greg Maddox for the Cubs. Mike Trout glove work insert for the Angels. <clears throat> Sorry again, guys. Jesse Chavez for the Angels in the hollow foil. Mookie Betts for the Red Sox is our photo variation short print. Untouchables insert for the Braves. Danny Ortiz. This has... Um, Honestly, it's not marked as a short print, but it uh, it feels like short print. And by that, I mean the texture of this card is not the same as the texture of the other cards. It's, um, I don't know. So it's not marked as a short print, but by the code on the back, but <clears throat> it doesn't feel like the other cards do. And it's not flip stock either. It's not that the back is the, uh, you know, that the front is rough and the back is the glossy part so i'm not quite sure what's going on there with danny ortiz but he does not uh feel like the regular normal card so i'm going to assume that he might be some sort of a short print and set him aside Trying to get the little sorting mat uh, organized over there.
Kurt Suzuki for the Braves to 2017. All rookie cup for the Rays, Evan Longoria. <clears throat> Aaron Judge photo variation short print. So that gives us both the Judge and the Bellinger. For the Giants, Nick Hundley. I call this the uh, negative, but I don't really know what it's actually supposed to be called. But to me, it looks like a photo negative, so I call it a negative variation. Joey Gallo for the Rangers in the 30th anniversary card. Yeah, it's just a regular, I guess, for, yeah, for Daniel Murphy. Buyback card for the Mariners. That's in uh, a kind of copper-colored stamp on it. If you're keeping track of that sort of thing. For the Mariners in the hollow foil. Prince Fielder for the Brewers, all rookie cup. Ozzie Smith for the Cardinals, photo variation short print. Corey Seager for the Dodgers in our 30th anniversary parallel. Our all-star stitches are for Garcia for the Chicago White Sox. That's going to bring us to our third and final box here on this back half. Justin Haley for the Twins to 2017. Sensatella for the Rockies in the rookie insert. Robinson Cano for the Mariners is our photo variation short print. Untouchables Randy Johnson for the Mariners. Hank Aaron Award Buster Posey for the Giants, our manufactured relic. Buyback card is uh, Larry Sutton for the Royals. Hi, Shane Easton. Um, no, this is the only break that we have tonight, or this is the last break of the night. We did the autographed baseball earlier. <coughs> Excuse me. And then, of course, this is the uh, half case of Update Series Jumbo. And then that's all we have scheduled for tonight. Not 100% sure what breaks tomorrow night, but there's something scheduled.
But it hadn't yet ended, of course. It would still be active on eBay, the stuff for tomorrow night. Ryan Braun for the Brewers walk-off insert. Gene Segura in the hollow foil. Giancarlo in our photo variation short print. Untouchables, Randy Johnson for the D-backs. We're back to, uh, yeah, back to our regular cards there after that. Shane, was there something in particular you were looking for? Oh, gotcha. Yeah, I do have, um, I have another jumbo case of update that I haven't broken yet. I also have a case of regular wax update that I haven't broken yet, but I'm not going to be breaking them for, uh, probably a little over a week from now because I've got, uh, I'm going to be doing some traveling, so I'm not going to, I'm not going to try to rush back and, and do that at night when I've got stuff going on during the day. Kansas City Royals to 2017. So most everything I've got past uh, Sunday will wait and we'll, we'll break, uh, you know, about a week or so after that. Ryan Sandberg, All-Rookie Cup. Dansby Swanson is our uh, short print photo variation. So how about that? We pulled, uh, we've pulled Dansby and Cody and Aaron all in this break in their short print variations, which that's the first time that's happened. So now if we can just, uh, <clears throat> maybe we could find Moncada and Bregman, we'd be in pretty good shape. Bryce Harper on the 30th anniversary. Tim Flannery is one of our analysts. That's one that will go off to random shortly. Another one, another one of the buyback cards. This one is for the Braves. That is kind of a copper color stamp on it. Second rider for the Marlins hollow foil. Jose Canseco is our all rookie cup. Bradley Zimmer, our uh, photo variation short print. Matt Waiters, our 30th anniversary.
Craig Kembrell for the Red Sox is going to be our card numbered to 2017. Fernando Valenzuela. Oh, Babe Ruth, our photo variation short print for the Yankees. Starlin Castro, our 30th anniversary card also for the Yankees. What have we found in here so far? Just our Hank Aaron Award, right? Have we found our? Yeah, I think we found that. Well, I can tell you. There's one, two, three. Yeah, so we've already found our Hank Aaron Award. We haven't yet found our signature hit or our all-star stitches out of this box. Joe Jimenez for the Tigers is our card numbered to 2017. Andrew McCutcheon, throwback jersey insert for the Pirates. Mark McGuire, photo variation short print for the A's. Untouchables for the Braves. Oops, I'm sorry guys, I Clayton Kershaw jumped ship on me there. He doesn't seem to be any worse for the wear, so thank goodness for that. That's, uh, I guess that's why we have the breaking mats, right? For the times when one accidentally goes off sides on us. Or on me, rather. hit the camera. I think it did, didn't I? Uh, tried to straighten it back out there. Brewers. Glove work insert. Pirates. Hollow foil. Mets photo variation short print. Untouchables for the Jays. Reds with the, uh, again, what I call negative uh, insert. The next dynasty is our card numbered to 2017 for the Yankees. Mark McGuire, all rookie cup reprint. And there's our Alex Bregman uh, photo variation short print. So we got pretty close to hitting the trifecta. Um, well, it's not really a trifecta because there's more than three, I think, that I named off. But anyway, 
Cody Bellinger 30th anniversary. We're close to hitting all of our high profile rookies in their short print photo variations in this break. Maybe you still need to hit Moncada and Rangers Kevin Brown, the copper stamp on it. And you can see that one definitely has a terrible corner down there on that bottom uh, right. That's like all bent up or chipped off or bent back. I don't know. At any rate, that one has seen better days for sure. I think I might see our All-Star Stitches Relic. Coming up in this pack, I believe. Rays with the hollow foil. All-Star Rookie Cup, Cal Ripken. Buster Posey, photo variation short print. <clears throat> Christian <laughs> Christian Yellick <coughs> is our 30th anniversary. Our all-star stitches is Nelson Cruz for the Mariners. So we should have in our last pack back there one signature hit left to find. Then we'll have a couple of things we'll have to take care of in random. But we are nearing the finish line on this one. Severino to 2017. Pineda, pitching performance insert. Pedro Martinez, our photo variation short print for the Red Sox. Untouchables, Corey Kluber, Indians. Our signature hit, Brett Phillips for the Brewers. And then the rest is base. And then we'll be buzzing over into random momentarily. And after we do uh, random, then we will recap. Let me get these over onto the sorting mat and out of the line of fire, so to speak. And then we'll move on and get the rest of this taken care of. Okay, so um, we have these cards for the Major League Baseball analysts and hosts. Those three cards right there are, are going to be awarded in random to one team. Then coming to America, let's see, looks like we have... Uh, that's the one I've still got to look up and see where he played the longest. So coming to America, we have five of them. So we'll send uh, a couple to the Rangers. We'll send a couple to the Astros. Those are the ones that are shown on the card. Then the extra one will go to the random spot. M is for mashing. We have four. Uh, so we will send two to Baltimore and two to Cleveland. And then this guy here will end up going to the team that he played for the longest. So let's first uh, buzz back over here to the spreadsheet so I can pull all of our teams. And then what we'll do, or what I will do, is we'll I will take, uh, copy and paste this. We're going to drop it in at random.org. And because we have 30 items in there, I don't really see the need to do random multiple times. I mean... It's kind of the whole point of using the service, right? Is it's like completely random no matter if you do it once or ten times. But anyway, we're going to do it once. And 
whoever comes out on the top, whatever team comes out on top after we hit random is going to take that little group of cards home. And that comes up as the Diamondbacks. So the Diamondbacks will get uh, these three analyst cards and then this one uh, leftover coming to America. Again, the other coming to America will be split evenly between the Rangers and the Astros, the two teams shown on the card. And then M is for mashing will be split equally between the Orioles and the Red Sox because they are the two shown on that card. And let's do our hits recap here. For our numbered cards uh, that are numbered lower than 2017, that is. For the Rays, that's numbered to 50. For the Marlins, that is numbered to 66. Our two cards for the negative parallel. One for the Reds. The other for the Giants. Quick rundown of our short print photo variations. This entire stack, short print photo variations. I didn't see any SSPs. That is actually not a short print photo variation. I'll go back to that one in a minute. I didn't notice any SSPs in this one. I'll double check it uh, before I ship it out. If there is one, I'll make a note of it of course, uh, in with your shipment, but I think those are all standard short prints, no super short prints. This is the one that the code says it's a normal card, but it doesn't feel like a normal card. The texture on it is different, so I'm not really quite sure what's going on with it. It's not a short print, but it is different than the normal card, so for whatever that is worth. Our signature hits, Brett Phillips for the Brewers. Joe Jimenez, for the Tigers, Anthony Alford for the Blue Jays, our Relics, Nelson Cruz for the Mariners, All-Star Stitches, Garcia All-Star Stitches for the White Sox, Bettences All-Star Stitches for the Yankees, Hank Aaron Award, Buster Posey, Giants, Miguel Cabrera, Tigers, and a little Bryce Harper for the Nats. And that's all for tonight. Uh, again, plan on seeing this ship out most likely on Monday. It's possible some could go into uh, Tuesday. It's also possible some could get out sooner, but I think we're probably looking at Monday for that. In the meantime, uh, you know, we've got other stuff listed that'll be breaking uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday night before we take a little few nights off. So if, if it tickles your fancy, take a look, see what else I've got coming up. Hopefully I'll